the March. We're supposed to be having the New York trial this week. Uh, it just doesn't. And somehow the government just sent discovery to Trump that was requested a long time ago. And, and Alvin Bragg thought they got all of it. And then they just sent some this past week. And now he needs time to review it. And so does like Alvin a million Bragg. documents. So, so they, it's like, so the prosecution had asked for all this documentation. Trump's side got it a year ago. They just got it dumped on their front door like last week. So Alvin Bragg had to go, we need 30 more days to extend it. So I am tired and I want you guys to know, I don't want to do another Armageddon update or do another Seriously. podcast about mm -hmm. this asshole. But, and here's why Trump works. Here's, here's why. Because he does all this shit and it's happening now to me is that we are all coming to a place where we're just fucking to, all right, fine. Just let him do it. And someone pointed out on the news today or yesterday that what he's doing is he, the longer he makes you wait for this stuff, the longer he pushes it. Mm -hmm. At one point, you forgot what he did. Yeah. At one point, you yes. don't you don't know anymore why yes. why are we in this situation? He's using time as a as his weapon. That's yeah, his shield because the memory fades. Yep. Don't forget, people, that this man sent people. I was watching video of the uh, January sixth thing. People had poles were breaking windows. They were beating the shit out of police officers. They were ganging up on them. Fanon got, they zapped, they tased him. It caused him a heart attack. We, they, one guy died. Uh, they were throwing a fire extinguisher cops' heads. Like, don't forget, why lo go watch that footage. If you have any question, and the media, I blame the fucking media. Do you know why? Everybody, and I'm talking across the board, CNN, MSNBC, the most, pick the most liberal site. Everybody seems to be talking about this guy like he's a normal candidate. Yeah, it blows my mind. You were just talking like, well, Trump's, you know, the presented. I watched Steve Kornacki, who I respect, going, well, you know, Trump could get this one and this one. Hey, hey, Steve, why didn't you say guy who tried to overthrow the government? The traitor Trump could get because that would be biased. But it's not biased if it's true. The thing that blows my mind, though, is that, for example, we were talking about this last night. He is now opening his rallies, playing a different national anthem. It's the one that he recorded with the January 6th choir, the, the hostages, criminals, the hostages, the hostages. And he walks out at his rally and salutes. And these people have their hands over their hearts to this other national anthem. Sung by guys in prison for trying to end the, they're to singing the, the national. So let me just say, make my point. He is now in that rally saying that. It was a peaceful day. They're hostages. They're being held by crooked Joe Biden and they did nothing wrong. I'm going to release them on day one. And then we watched the video yesterday where he, when he was still in office, the day after January 7th, goes and records that video where he says the violence that took place on our nation's capital yesterday was unprecedented and uncalled for and the people will be punished. He admits how violent January 6th mm -hmm. was. Mm -hmm. He details it. And now all those right wing people, some of my family included, are saying it wasn't an insurrection. It wasn't violent. Nobody died. Um, Wait, the, uh, nobody Signet died. Didn't no. die from that. He had he legally technically had a heart attack is what it says on the. But that's probably because he was being hit in the head with a fire extinguisher. But that's their stance is that he died of a heart attack. And we talk about this. So, so we much. have a video where he says this happened. Yeah, he it was say, violent he, and it's bad and it should says, never happen. Whoever did this, it was against. We are a peaceful country. We shouldn't do this. Yes. You can't go against the United States government. And now yes. he's saying it didn't happen. And everyone's like, yep, it didn't happen. But this is because he spent the first, whatever, three, three plus years downplaying it, saying it, it was something else, right? All right? He did the same exact thing with the vaccine and COVID and all that shit. Yeah. And right at the very, very end after it was all, the vaccine's rolling out and he's like, you should go get the vaccine. And then he's out. Yeah. He's full of shit. They don't he care, spends all though. that time. How do they not care? He, he That is. he says everything and contradicts himself and because blames Reagan everyone. Because Reagan disassembled the education system in the <laughs> 80s. And, and what ended up happening is now those people are now grown adults who don't have any training in critical thinking. They can't think through it. They're just like, and the, the problem is this, is that you, you, you can watch him say one thing, him say another thing, diametrically opposed to what, to uh, whatever he's talking about. You can go to the rallies of this time, 
the people said what he said the first time, mm-hmm. same exact people said the same, changed their mind and said the second thing. Like, so he's- Well, he spends, it's all that time that he, after they have been indoctrinated with the initial bit of information and it's and it locks in and they and they hold on to it and they never listen to if he says it three years later from now they're already convinced they've already got it baked in today it's almost like they listen for their one thing yeah Yeah. and then they that's the one they hold on to Mm -hmm. even though he then contradicts himself Mm -hmm. and changes it's like it's the craziest thing then they even make excuses for that and say like oh he's just saying that because of the deep state is gonna or whatever then they even make up bullshit that he's saying it because of something else what's what's going on with the deep state Uh, because have they has the deep state um turned on our your chips yet Guys, your your microchips? No, 